हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू आर ऑल डूइंग वेल आई मन हर एंड वेलकम बैक टू एम एस एफ टी वेबकास्ट टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डाइव इन टू वन ऑफ द कूलेस्ट फीचर ऑफ विंडोज इलेवन विंडोज सैंड बॉक्स इफ यू एवर वॉन्टेड टू ट्राई समथिंग रिस्की और एक्सपेरिमेंट विथ सॉफ्टवेयर विदाउट मैसिंग अप यू ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम विंडोज सैंड बॉक्स इज परफेक्ट फॉर यू इट लेट्स यू क्रिएट अ टेम्पररी आइसोलेटेड एनवायरमेंट when you can run untrusted apps and files safely and the best part it's quick to set up and easy to use before enabling windows sandbox on your windows 11 device it's important to verify that your system meets the necessary requirements let's discuss the prerequisites for running windows sandbox on windows 11 device first thing first Windows Sandbox is only available on Windows 11 Pro Enterprise or Education editions. So if you are using Windows 11 Home, you don't be able to use this feature. A 64-bit processor with at least two CPU cores. Four cores with hyperthreading recommended. Virtualization capabilities must be enabled in BIOS or UEFI. At least 4 GB of RAM, 8 GB recommended. Let's see the steps. How to enable and set up Windows Sandbox on Windows 11 device? On your Windows 11 device, open Run menu, type appvis.cpl and press Enter. Click on Turn Windows Features on or off. In the Windows Features window, scroll down to Windows Sandbox and check the box next to Windows Sandbox. If the Windows Sandbox option is unavailable, Your computer doesn't meet the requirements to run Windows Sandbox. Click okay and wait for the installation process to complete. This will take some time to enable Windows Sandbox feature on this Windows 11 device. Once the installation is complete, click restart now to restart your Windows 11 computer and enable the Windows Sandbox feature. Now you can run the Sandbox to install and test applications without risking the main installation. After the restart, sign in to your Windows 11 computer again. Windows Sandbox should now show up as an app in your start menu. From there, you can launch it for a fresh, isolated Windows environment. Open Start menu and search for Sandbox. Select Run as administrator. Click on Yes. It may take about 30 seconds to load. as it sets up the isolated virtual machine environment once loaded you will see a fresh windows 11 desktop inside the sandbox this is your isolated environment completely separate from your main pc anything you do here whether it's installing software or testing potentially risky files will remain within this isolated space you can now download files within windows sandbox try downloading a test file even potentially risky software to see how windows defender responds within this safe environment install any application within sandbox notice how it behaves and explore the software as you would on your main system when you are done simply close windows sandbox you will receive a message confirming that all data inside the sandbox will be erased confirm and the sandbox will close leaving no trace of the programs or files you tested windows sandbox is invaluable for testing unknown or risky files and applications experimenting with system settings or exploring new software without impacting your main system each session starts fresh ensuring a safe environment every time it's also a powerful way to practice troubleshooting and security management without the risk of permanent changes Windows Sandbox gives you a safe isolated environment to test software in very much like using a virtual machine but even simpler to use we have successfully enabled and set up the Windows Sandbox feature on Windows 11 PC that's all for this video on how to set up Windows Sandbox on Windows 11 computer i hope you found this video helpful and informative if you have any questions or comments Feel free to leave them below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on Microsoft Hyper-V and other Microsoft related topics. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.